Hey there, friends. How are all of you today? We're so glad you're here. What's that you say? There's something on my hat. What could be on my hat? Oh my goodness. I see frogs and grasshoppers and a big old fly. Hmm. That must be a hint to today's Bible story. What story in the Bible has all of these things in it? Do you think you know? If you want to check your answer, go to your beginner's Bible, page 104, and see if you're right. So today we have a great story for you told by Pastor Mike. We have a craft by Miss Beth. And of course, Miss Krista will be with us today. And Miss Krista will be singing in right, out right, upright, down right, happy all the time. So get your singing voices ready and get ready to have some fun. The story of the 10 plagues. Moses and Aaron went to Pharaoh's palace. They said, you must let the Israelites go free or God will punish you. Pharaoh said, no, I do not know your God. And then he made the Israelites work even harder. God was not pleased. So God changed the main river into blood. Pharaoh did not care. I will never let the Israelites go, he said. Then God sent Rebe, Rebe, frogs, frogs to Egypt. They were sitting in chairs, hopping up the stairs, jumping up and down on beds. Pharaoh said, take those frogs away and I will let your people go. So God took the frogs away. But Pharaoh changed his mind. No, he said. So God sent more plagues to Egypt. First were the pesky gnats, then came a frenzy of flies. Next, all of the animals got sick. And then all of the Egyptians got horrible sores all over their skin. Damaging hailstorms came, and then swarms of locusts came and ate all the crops. Then darkness. Darkness covered everything. Sometimes Pharaoh would say he'd let the people go. But after God took away each plague, Pharaoh always changed his mind. No, he said. Moses had one last message from God. Pharaoh, he said, if you do not let my people go, the firstborn son of every Egyptian family will die. Pharaoh refused to listen, and so God kept his promise. Finally, Pharaoh said, go now. The story of the 10 plagues. Hi boys and girls, welcome to Craft Time with Miss Beth. In today's story, Moses and Aaron went to the Pharaoh's palace and they said to him, you better let the Israelites free because if you don't, God's going to punish you. Do you think, did the Pharaoh say, okay, or did he say no? You'd be right if you said that he said no. So God wasn't very happy with him. He made 10 plagues or really bad things happen in Egypt. And today's craft is going to help you remember what those 10 things were. You'll need markers and you'll need this little tiny brad and you'll need your two pages like this from your craft packet. First thing you're going to do is take your markers and color these. Color them any way you want. And when you're done coloring, if you're not able, then have your grown-up or your helper cut them out like this. The one will have the notch in it like that. And then you'll take your brad and I'd say poke it through this one first, only because this one is much easier to find the center. So you'll put it through there, but then you have to pull it back out so that you can line it up. All right, and you'll go through there and there, and then you'll open it up. And when you're all done, it'll look like this. And 
this spins around and it will help you remember what the ten plagues were. For example, there's the first one where he made all the water turn to blood. The second one where he made the frogs come, etc., etc. Have fun crafting! Hi friends, today we're gonna sing in right, out right, up right, down right. So get your hands ready, point in, point out, point up, and point down. Let's try it. I'm in right, out right, up right, down right, happy all the time. I'm in right, out right, up right, down right, happy all the time. Since Jesus Christ came in and cleansed my heart from sin, I'm in right, out right, up right, down right, happy all the time. Now we're going to sing it super slow. Ready? I'm in right, out right, up right, down right, happy all the time. I'm in right, out right, up right, down right, happy all the time. Since Jesus Christ came in and cleansed my heart from sin, I'm in right, out right, up right, down right, happy all the time. And now, let's do it super fast. Get your hands ready. I'm in right, up right, up right, down right, happy all the time. I'm in right, up right, up right, down right, happy all the time. Since Jesus Christ came in and cleansed my heart from sin, I'm in right, up right, up right, down right, happy all the time. Good job today, friends. I will see you again soon. Bye-bye. I hope you had fun today. Don't forget, we want to see your art, so share it with us so we can include it in our art gallery. Also, check out JJ in worship today. You never know what things he is up to. And remember, my friends, as you live your life this week, remember God's big two rules. Number one, love God above all else. Number two, love your neighbor as yourself. Have a great week, everybody. We will see you next time. Bye.